Hey Tepi Squad, welcome to another video. If you're new here, welcome. And if you've been part of the Tepi Squad for a while now, if you've been part, if you've been here, welcome back, honey. In case if you don't know who I am, the name is Bui Tepo Zagia, mainly known as Tepi Zagia, the owner of this channel. Please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Click on that post notification bell so that you can be notified every time I drop a video. Please don't forget to follow me on all my social media platforms. It's at Tepi underscore Zakia. TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, Jorge Reon. So today I'm back with the story time. Okay, this is something that happened recently. Um, it's not, it's not Kaligua. It's this past weekend you know, i have this friend of mine her name is for story sake we're gonna call her palisa so palisa nalene palisa we're constantly together if you want me you'll find me go palisa at basically if you want to know where i am you can text palisa she'll tell you where i am fine so um nale palisa palisa texted me during the week i think it was on a tuesday she told me told me we're going to a party this saturday i was like i'm game i'm down i mean i don't have any gig i don't have anything like how to what am i going to do hey oh no fine the next week <laughs> it's only on the friday when we were together preparing for the party Balisa slept over here she didn't come with any clothes so she slept over and then we decided to do my hair and then the next day in the morning which is what which is on the saturday which was on the day of the actual party that we we're supposed to go to uh we continued doing my hair in the morning and then after that we went to her place uh fetched her clothes the clothes that she was supposed to wear at the party and then basically we went to we after that we went to morena mall went to buy food went to chicken licken bought food and then we came back to my place continued with doing my hair while we're doing my hair uh, her other friend called her we're gonna call for story's sake we're gonna call this girl is manga because this girl une is manga guys like une is manga i'm not gonna lie to you guys okay fine is manga texted palisa she was like um i saw uh, for story's sake we're gonna call this guy peter because he's also part of the characters of my story time today fine she was like i saw peter's story i saw peter's status on whatsapp uh peter posted a party that is going on a party that is happening in unit two uh so i'd like to go i don't know if you guys are going if you aren't let's go and then palisa was like to her Girl, we are going to that party, so if you want to tag along, you can come. Fine, we also have this other friend. We're going to call him Josh. So Josh, Josh, uh, Josh decided that he also wants to go to the party with us. So we were like, ah, man, you know what? Let's go to the party. Fine, so basically we carried on with the day. Done my, we did my hair did everything that we're supposed to do now we are waiting on uh ismanga and josh right so while we are waiting on ismanga and josh ismanga said we should bolt for her she's at unit nine she wants to come to unit two so she will not use the taxi we should bolt for her she'll pay for the bolt that's nothing we were like okay girl that's not a problem we'll bolt for you uh we organized a bolt for her the bolt went and fetched uh is manga at unit nine she came to unit two okay while palisa went to fetch is manga outside here in my room here at the place i stayed while palisa went and fetched is manga outside josh was like i'm in a taxi and i'm nearby so i think you guys should go to the corner and go and fetch me so I was like, okay, since well, Palisa went to fetch his manga, well, let me go and fetch Josh. Fine, I went to the corner, fetched Josh, and then we all came to my room. Well, we were chilling, waiting for Nako Ichaya, basically, for us to go to the party. And then while we added, me and Palisa went to take a bath. Me and Palisa bathed after us taking a bath. We came back here and chilled the little Josh. They were eating. 
reduce the cloud and all of that. Okay, it was time. I think around nine o'clock we decided, Horman, let's go to the party. No, we went to the party. We walked there. When we got there, we just wanted to see the vibe, decide whether we're going to stay there or we're going to move to another location for us to go party there. Fine. Uh, we got to the party. It was not really, really popping at that time, but we were like, no, man, we're going to stay here. It's fine. We've decided. Right? Right. Fine. And then we decided, oh, no, man, let's go to Star Shop, go get some booze. Well, we bolted to Star Shop, bought booze, and then we came back. The same bolt that took us there. I spoke to the driver, can you please just wait for us here? And then you'll take us back to the location. We don't mind pay paying double. The bull driver was like, okay, that's not a problem. And then um, we went back to the party. It was popping. Yeah, it was popping. after Bastrata, Umlando versus Umlando. basically You understand? So we partied and partied and partied and partied and partied until 12 in the like 12 midnight, if I'm not mistaken. When we got to the party, ne? There was this other guy. His name is Peter. We are all familiar with Peter. Peter was was with his friend. We're gonna call him Sponge, ne? Sponge and this other one. We're gonna call him Graham, ne? I don't know. Like um, Sponge and Graham are not really important in the story time, but yeah. So. Uh, Peter, Sponge, and Graham were like, we're changing locations because it's very boring here. Yeah. So they told us that we're going to this other place. We're going to call it Venice, Club Venice. We're going to Club Venice. So um, you guys will decide whether you're coming with us or not. Ismanga was like, no, we're going. We're going with you guys. Ing, ing. And we were like, Ismanga, we've already spent a lot of money on Bolt and on booze. So, if we go to Venice, it means we'll have to buy booze again. And then, um, Josh, no, not Josh, not Josh, not Josh, guys. Yo, my name is confused. And then, uh, Spongy was like, guys, no, you guys don't have to buy booze. They know us at Venice. Basically, Rikastenika Kula Box, we'll just uh, take the one one, chill. And then, it would be a process, yeah, whenever we want, any one of us wants a drink, we'll go and fetch the drink and whatnot. Fine. Uh, the girl said, Ismanga said she wa she'll bolt, so she bolted, and she was like, she'll pay for the bolt. Okay, fine. Ismanga paid for the bolt. The bolt came. Ritamilika bolted a two. Inile bolt, yabo Peter, and then bolt, yaka, palisa, George, and Ismanga. Fine. Uh -huh. We changed locations. We went to Venice. When we got to Venice, ah, uh, man, Venice is not really that popping, but it's popping. Um, it was my first time going to Venice, so I go Venice. We chilling, homonate, and whatnot. Fine. It was time for Venice to close. Okay, and then Spongy was like, "No, we can go at home. We can go and chill at my place at home." Fine. Spongy was like, we're going there, ne? Guys, please do me a favor. Please don't make a lot of noise. My mother just lives, my mother lives front opposite of where I am sleeping. Kure, it's, it's the yard where I'm sleeping at and the yard where my mother stays. So basically, I'd like you guys to not make a lot of noise because if she hears that noise, she's going to chase us away. Fine. <laughs> We got to Spongy's home, we chilled, and then Peter's sister and uh, family member came. We chilled with them. It was popping. Fine, fine, fine. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. It was a party, it was everything. It was lit, it was nice. Fine. While we are chilling, um, Ismanga shows Balesa a text from Peter. Peter said to her, Let's go outside. 
Peter says to Ismanga, let's go outside. Mind you, I didn't tell you guys this, but I'm telling you guys this now. And then, Peter is Ismanga and Palesa's friend's ex. Basically, Palesa's friend, Palesa and Ismanga's friend is Peter's ex. You understand? Recent ex, not ex, ya, kale, kwa, kaka, 19 fan tuka, eh, eh. Ex, ya, malobanyan helayana this year. You understand? Fine. So, Palisa was like to his manga, you know that he's mm, our friend's ex. So, I suggest you don't entertain him that much. Fine. It was not a big deal. Mogele was like, okay. No, we are chilling. And then, Palisa like felt sad hore. Why is Peter like um doing this to me? Peter is Palisa's friend. Like they have been friends for a very long time. Ever since high school. Fine. And then um Palisa was like, why is Peter doing this to me? Like each and every friend yaka. Peter wants to sleep with them. Peter wants to, you know. Sleep with every friend, yaka. Basically, you understand? No, man. And then Palisa, I found Palisa crying in the room. I was like, Palisa, why are you crying? Palisa was like, Peter is going out with every friend, is making out with every friend, yaka. If I introduce them to a friend of mine at a party, he wants to sleep with basically every friend that I come with. Fine. And then um, his manga went to. Palisa and she was like, no friend, I'm not going to sleep with this guy, man. Don't worry. It won't happen. I won't do that. Ne? Mind you, Peter is dating Palisa's friend. Ne? Palisa's other friend. Ne? Chong, like Peter, was busy with Palisa's three friends. Basically, it was his manga, the ex, and Palisa's current friend, other friend, that Peter is dating. You understand? Fine. So it happened, Hore. Palisa. I get it. Is manga said to Palisa that I won't do anything with this guy. Palisa chilled and she was like, okay, fine. Since well, she won't do anything with Peter, it means we are on a safe side. Hore, I don't talk about Hore getting stressed that much. Fine. <laughs> it was a party. Zaga ding dang, ding ding. Zaga ding dang, zaga ding ding. Zaga ding ding ding. Doko dong dong. Zaga 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 ding. Paga zaga zaga dan. Zaga ding zaga ding. Dok dong dong. Basically, there was a party. Fine. While we were chilling, the family member was playing. Anne, she was joking, saying to Peter, "Nala na we are leaving right now." So his manga got jealous. Peter, you can't say to me, "Hore, we should go outside." Meanwhile, you know that you have another girlfriend here. She did not know that this is Peter's family member. This is Peter's. You know, something, something. She's family. So she started giving attitude to Peter's family member and uh, Peter's little sister, who came with a family member. So hey, hey, she started giving them attitude, a brega and whatnot. So uh, Peter's family member was like, Peter, then why is this girl giving me uh, weird vibes when I say I'm going to chill with you? How do we're going to leave Nanwe? We live in the same home. So basically, if I say we're going to leave, we're going to leave. Well, she didn't know. I get it. It's the family member. Fine. And then Peter was like, Ay, you guys are boring. You guys are annoying. Just because uh, this girl is now angry. Jorge, the family member said uh, they're going to leave. One time. So Peter, I get it. Or what? Or what? and whatnot fine and then um the family member and the little sister decided for no man we are leaving here we are leaving as in when they were leaving peter took his manga to the room right right that very same room it's where my phone is charged it's where my charger is it's where my handbag is i forgot to tell you guys that i uh, borrowed his manga I borrowed his manga my handbag uh, for her to put her stuff inside. You understand? Fine. No, man. Uh, we were chilling, 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 chilling. And then while they were in the room, right? Um, 
as and when they were in the room we were chilling i get go go sitting room rotate the family member and the little sister came back with another friend you understand that friend is a vibe i really really like her yeah she's a vibe you understand she knows me from youtube and facebook and all of that i don't know her until that day but she's a vibe i don't regret meeting her you understand fine no <laughs> We chilled the whole monat, the whole shukiri, and all of that. And then Peter called Spongy to the room and told Spongy whatever he told him. Uh, basically, I should tell you guys what, what he told Spongy because it's part of the important things of the story time. He said to Spongy that his manga says that uh, uh, Palesa said to her that. Peter is her boyfriend and they are sleeping together. Basically, when Peter's actual girlfriend is not here, she is Peter's girlfriend. You guys should remember that his manga is Balisa's friend. More than she is to Peter. You understand? Generally, Peter, they are chatting on WhatsApp, but she is Balisa's friend. If ever she had to go to the party with um, Peter... If they were that close, she would have went to the party with Peter without consulting Palisa. Just telling Palisa that we'll meet at the party. But because she's more of Palisa's friend, she said to Palisa that, Can I go to the party with you guys? We'll meet little Peter. Go pay. You understand? Fine. So Spongy couldn't hold it in. She told, uh, she decided to, he decided to go outside with Palisa and told Palisa everything. Palisa was like, why would I do that? Why would I say such a thing? I just did not want um, uh, his manga sleeping with uh, Peter because Peter is doing that to all of my friends. And I mentioned it to her. It had nothing to do with me saying that I'm dating Peter. So Palisa told me because it didn't sit right with her. <laughs> you guys know me. Attitude mode yaka kai palama e palama in number six mo stofo e palama stofo in number six. I decided to marry this girl. Ne, if he and Peter wanted to sleep together, why should they include Palisa inside? Palisa outside guy in this whole thing. Fine, I decided to man. Mm -mm. I'm gonna have an attitude towards this girl, and I'm gonna show her who I am. Fine. Because Palisa cannot do that. She's sad. Like if I'm going to do it on, in, on her behalf. She's my friend. This is my friend. What the fucking hell are you doing? Hey, hey, you can't do that. Fine. So Josh. Josh was very sleepy ever since we got to Gorobo Sponji. He decided to go and sleep. And then Palisa joined her because she was very sad and tired. She was like, no, let me just go and sleep to avoid me saying things that I'm not supposed to say. Fine. They made out uh, Peter and his manga. They made out. They did what they did. It's fine. It's none of our business. They're two adults. They can do and decide whatever they wanted to do. So while they were busy, I was like to Spongy, please go and fetch my charger at that room. Spongy was like, Mari, you know people are busy in there. Why should I uh, disturb them by going to fetch a uh, charger and all of that? I was like, go and fetch my charger. He went and fetched my charger. Remember, I said my handbag was with the girl, right? So my phone needed I decided, no man, Spongy, go and charge my, char go and charge my phone again. Okay, Spongy went and charged my phone. I, I think they heard me throwing shade while while I was in the living room. I was like, imagine Ukwatela, someone's family member, just because you, you were jealous. Imagine uh, going to backstab your friend and bad name her just because you want to sleep with a guy. Imagine sleeping with a guy that dated your friend. I know not all of us believe in the girl code, but I do. And I don't care if she doesn't because... um. That ex of Peter is her friend. And the only Peter is happy when you want to do whatever you're doing with her. Why? Why do you want to do that? Fine. Mm -mm. I decided to no, man. Fine, I'm going to act up. Hey, hey. We started screaming. The girl that I said I enjoyed her company. Uh, we started screaming, partying. Ing, ing. Yo, Umantuli came. Sponge's mother came. She was like, Lena Hana Mohaga came up being beam. Lena Hana came up guest house. Gun! Hey, I had to go to the room, 
fetched my charger and said to the, the to to his manga say I said to her please borrow me my handbag and I didn't my I didn't say my handbag please borrow me that bag I didn't want people to know that it's my bag I didn't want people to know that I borrowed her that bag I just wanted my bag because I had no intentions of coming back with his manga to my place she was not coming back here because she backstabbed my friend fine me only went to where josh and uh, palisa is sleeping remember i didn't tell you guys that josh is gay so there was no way that they'd have sex with uh palisa so me just saw a guy and a girl she was like you guys are sleeping having sex on my child's bed while they're doing my trick lanyela lanyela tswa mo ka morenya ngwana ke tsama ya get out we left while we are walking we are walking to um this other guy that is our friend's place while we are walking there i'm trying to make this go away that when you are not leaving with us on the road i was like guys haratswamo we are leaving it would be me palisa and josh tsa gore ba bang ba tsena kae ba tshwang bone gore ba tsena kae i don't give a fuck i don't know them so i don't care Fine that's where girl picked up her oh this one is giving me attitude. Josh didn't understand why we giving this girl attitude because he was sleeping all the like uh, uh, like na kwe everything he did khala he was sleeping. So he was like girl zia no why le trapi sa ngwana what's going on? Hey, and then we gave Josh the story. So um Peter Spongy and this girl and all the other friends decided to go to the shop and buy whatever they were buying. I think never like material habi. And then we went to the friend's place Rebasia basically. Fine while we were at the friend's place they came in. I decided to sleep because I was so angry. I I decided to sleep because I was going to show this girl who I really am I, and I didn't want her gore abone mo gwa ka gore ke molala who fair. Fine. While we at it, um, and then uh, who's this? Uh, Peter started uh, acting weird towards Palisa. He didn't want Palisa to smoke his hab. He didn't want Palisa to do that, to do this, whatever, whatever. He was basically giving Palisa an attitude. Okay, that is how uh, things ended, basically. And then when they left, um, his manga basically texted. Uh, Palisa saying little saying hundred tranta ya kaya bolt. I was like, first and foremost, you came to my place. Car in it like a like a not in a bad way, guys. Car in it like a like a. Rose has this style in jail. Rago bofale pano rahira munt for Peter to see you copy. Sis, you came to my place. You ate. You helped Josh. Josh is our friend. Josh is my friend actually, and Palisa's friend. Uh, his manga is not my friend. She's Palisa's friend and not my friend. So I wouldn't mind Josh coming to my place and eating my food. So his manga came when she saw Josh eating. She ate with Josh. Ojeledi jo tamo haka. You came and chilled mo haka. You used the styling gel. Tamo haka. You used everything. Ya mo haka. You even used my bag. And then after that, you you said that you'd paid for the bolt. No, you know, but I'm a dear bolt. So basically, I was like, "Next, we are not gonna pay for this bolt. This girl is very rude, and for the fact that you went and bad named your friend just because you want is a very wrong. Just because we're not like very wrong. So she annoyed me. She annoyed me to pits, guys. And I decided, "Hor my way again. This girl is fucked up. She's way too like I keep giving her tons and yang. Basically, that's what her." That's what happened, and after that, she decided to block Palisa and whatnot. I was like, "You can block her. It's fine. She can block you and do whatever." But for the fact that she bad named you, because she wanted someone's, you know, thingy. Uh uh, it was very wrong, and Peter was very wrong for believing what that girl said. Ngabane atzile Palisa shifted her to the side, and she was, and and he would have asked her at least. Why did you tell Ismanga that we are dating and that in, in, I understand that you want to protect my girlfriend and your friend, but why would you do that? Mare, he didn't do that and he decided to act the young young towards Palisa. So basically, that's what happened and whatnot. Kurung manyanul moral of the story. Nashem na aje tsepi di chomi. Mo especially di chomi zelo kuri. If ever if ever kalu li chomi akat fine. Ilo kore ki kopa na luena because of bato. Nga sikho tse sirasi because ki bono kore bato wa yalo bante yang. 
So yeah, guys, that's basically my story time. That's what happened. I love you guys so much. Please don't forget to subscribe. Comment down below what you think. If I was wrong or if that one uh, girl was wrong, if Palisa was wrong or if Peter was wrong. Um, please don't forget to like. Uh, subscribe if you haven't. I love you guys so much. Bye.